someone asked me recently about how we deal with the two loaves of bread on Friday night and Shabbos. We know that on Shabbos, the Shulchan Aruch says that you have to have two loaves of bread. He has to have two loaves of bread when he makes a Kiddush. This is uh, something that the Gemara teaches us and uh, obviously has something to do with the importance of, uh, of, of uh, Shabbos. Something we don't do regularly, but we do do it on Shabbos, and those two loaves of bread have to be whole. They should not be broken or sliced. Now, in the Shulchan Aruch, again, Reish Ayin Dalet, I'm sorry, Reish Ayin Dalet, the Shulchan Aruch says, Botseya al shtei kikrot shleimot. That you have to have two whole loaves of bread before you start eating. And she ochei shtehem biyado, ochei shtehem, you hold on to both of them, as an indication that you're doing the mitzvah. So when you make the brocha, motzi lechem mina aretz, you're holding on to both of these chalas. And you're holding on to them in order to indicate that the mitzvah, that this time, hamotzi lechem bin aretz, is somehow being said on both of them. On, uh, on both of these, um, on both of these loaves of bread. And then the Shulchan says, the Mechaber says, botseya hatachtona. You break off the bottom. So now we understand that normally, if you hold two loaves of bread, you won't hold them side by side, but you hold one on top and one on the bottom. And the one that you, <coughs> the one that you use in order to eat with on Friday night is the bottom, is the bottom loaf. And that's what the, that's what the Mechaber in the Shulchan Aruch, that's what the Mechaber in the Shulchan Aruch says. This idea that you should be botzea tachtona um, was already questioned by the Bach. This the Mishnah Brewer points to immediately, and he says, we all know the ein ma'avir in our mitzvahs. In other words, if I have the opportunity to do a mitzvah with something that's close to me, or something that's further away, naturally I do the mitzvah with the thing that's close to me. So if I have two loaves of bread, and one is on the top and one is on the bottom. The one on the top is closer to me, and that's the one you would think um, you would think that I would use. Uh, and so uh, we looked for some kind of a way of solving this problem. So the Mishnah Brewer, the Mishnah Brewer points out, La Taz the Taz, who is a commentary on the Shulchan Aruch, the commentary. Uh, said that what happened was that the that the loaf of bread that he's holding underneath which usually would be further away than the one on top somehow you jiggle them around so that the that the top loaf is further away than the bottom loaf and and so you could do both at the same time. You can accomplish what the Shulchan Aruch tells you to do, which is to um, use the upper loaf. And you could also accomplish this rule of the mitzvah performance, which is Ein Mavirin Al HaMitzvahs.